Princess Anne, the epitome of grace and strength, recently faced a challenging ordeal after a horse-related incident left her hospitalized with a concussion. The incident, which occurred at her country estate on June 23, marked a momentary pause in the Princess Royal's relentless schedule of royal duties and engagements. However, despite the setback, Princess Anne's unwavering spirit and determination shine through as she embarks on a journey of recovery and self-reflection. In the wake of her hospitalization, Princess Anne's absence was palpably felt at a scheduled event in Canada. Even in moments of vulnerability, her commitment to her responsibilities and obligations remained unwavering. As the Canadian Governor-General conveyed her heartfelt sentiments during a memorial ceremony, Princess Anne's presence was deeply missed, but her message resonated with warmth and sincerity. Her words, though delivered from a distance, carried the weight of her enduring dedication to honoring the brave efforts and sacrifices of individuals who have made significant contributions to history. Reflecting on past engagements and shared experiences, Princess Anne's reminiscence of previous commemorations on the island of Newfoundland underscored her profound connection to the people and the events that shaped their collective history. Despite her physical absence, her emotional presence was keenly felt, transcending geographical boundaries and reaffirming her bond with those she holds dear. The aftermath of the incident brought to light the fragility of life and the vulnerability inherent in the pursuit of one's passions. Princess Anne's injuries, though largely undisclosed, serve as a poignant reminder of the inherent risks that come with her equestrian pursuits. The temporary memory loss she experienced serves as a testament to the resilience of the human spirit in times of adversity, as she navigates the uncertainties of her recovery with grace and fortitude. In the days following her release from the hospital, Princess and retreated to the solace of her country home in Gloucestershire, where she embarked on a journey of physical and emotional healing. Surrounded by the verdant landscapes of her estate, she found solace in the familiar embrace of nature, a welcome respite from the rigors of public life. Supported by a dedicated team of medical professionals, Princess Anne's path to recovery is guided by their expertise and her unwavering determination to regain her strength and vitality. As she navigates the challenges of her rehabilitation, Princess and return to public duties remains uncertain. With her well-being at the forefront of her decisions, she has entrusted her medical team with the final say on when it is safe for her to resume her royal responsibilities. The timeline of her return is shrouded in ambiguity, a reminder of the unpredictability of life and the importance of prioritizing one's health and well-being above all else. Throughout her illustrious career, Princess and has been lauded for her tireless work ethic and unwavering commitment to her role as a member of the royal family. Her resilience in the face of adversity, her dedication to duty, and her unyielding spirit have endeared her to the hearts of many. Despite the challenges she has faced, Princess Anne's indomitable will and unshakable resolve serve as an inspiration to all who have witnessed her journey of personal triumph and professional excellence. Princess Anne's journey from hospitalization to recovery is a testament to her strength, resilience, and unwavering commitment to her values and responsibilities. Her grace under pressure, her humility in times of vulnerability, and her determination to overcome obstacles serve as a beacon of hope and inspiration to all who admire her. As she continues her path to recovery and renewal, Princess and stands as a shining example of courage, fortitude, and unwavering resolve in the face of adversity.